Hi, I was standing out here since 7 a.m. watching the students line up right outside this front door, all standing a safe distance apart as teachers welcomed them inside while checking for masks. Good morning. Jody Hustick greets students on the first day of school at Crestview Elementary in Cottage Grove, escorting cars waiting in the parking lot. Yep, just go back around the parking lot. As eager students begin standing in line. They are taking the same precaution, you know, six feet apart and you know, we just hope and pray for the best. Sheik Sheriff woke up early to drop his sister off for the first day of in-person classes. They're just starting up and they have to go get back to school and, you know, being online is okay, but at least for us, our grown folks, you know, we can manage it, but for them, they need, like, at least be in person. South Washington County Schools started a hybrid learning model today, with some students meeting in person and others online. The district consists of 16 elementary schools, four middle schools, three comprehensive high schools, and one alternative. When we think about District 833, we have about 25% of our students that are learning virtually and 75% of our students that are here um, doing what we call our hybrid. Lorraine, oh my gosh, you're older than me. All right, have a good day. Husting says about one third of the teachers are doing distance learning and about two thirds are here on site. Some staff standing outside welcoming students. It's amazing having kids back at school today. Even though they were behind a mask, we could tell that there were a lot of smiles. We're so happy. Although wearing a mask may take some getting used to for a few. I don't like it. <laughs> Most students say they are excited to get back into the classroom. There are stu still a few cars left in the parking lot, but we do know this week students will alternate between in-class learning and distance. Back to you.